Thank you very much. After my daughter was murdered two weeks ago, I said on national television that that we have to do whatever it takes to fix this problem, whatever it takes to fix this problem. I know that weakening the stranglehold on the gun lobby is not going to be not going to happen overnight. Uh, I know, too, that passing background checks won't prevent all acts of gun violence from taking place. But if we can just stop, go through the pain and anguish that we can't stop now. We must continue to mount pressure on our, our elected officials here in Washington and at home in your home state. The, the, the overwhelming majority of Americans agree with common sense reforms. But, but too many members of Congress remain in the pocket of, of the gun lobby, and that has got to change. That's what you guys are doing. You are refusing. You are refusing to let grief turn into despair. Folks, that's what it's going to take to bring about change, keeping the pressure on our lawmakers until they do the right thing. It's just doing the right thing. And if they won't, we will find their replacement. Advocates across the country are holding more than 50 whatever-it-takes events from coast to coast.